A Milwaukee fire lieutenant is now charged with sexually assaulting a female co-worker. 35-year-old Michael Peden made his first court appearance today. Ben Jordan is live at the fire department headquarters where a news conference just wrapped up. Ben. George and Carol, more on that news conference in just a minute. Earlier this morning, Michael Peden made his first appearance in court. Tonight, he remains in jail waiting for a GPS tracking device. His attorney made one thing clear today. He denies all of the accusations. This Milwaukee fire lieutenant enters the courtroom. State of Wisconsin versus Michael Peden. After spending the past five days in jail. Charged with second degree sexual assault. Court records show the alleged victim in this case, a female firefighter who graduated from the fire academy last year, claims Peden, her superior at this Southside fire station, started by bullying her for her race and gender back in May. She says their encounters turned physical a few months later without her consent. The alleged victim told police Peden forced her to touch his private parts, grabbed her inappropriately and frequently touched her on the behind. Mr. Peden adamantly denies the accusations against him. Peden has served seven years as a Milwaukee firefighter. The lieutenant was suspended back in October due to these allegations. He has never been charged with a crime before, Your Honor. The state asks for more than just cash bail, requesting Peden wear a GPS tracking device and have no contact with the alleged victim. Peden's attorney, Rebecca Coffey, only arguing the tracking device would get in the way of his family life. However, the judge sides with the state's recommendation. I respectfully disagree with the defense that GPS is not necessary. Afterward, we caught up with coffee. If he maintains his innocence, what does he what, what does he say happened that day? I think I'm not going to be able to answer that question. Okay. Now, as for the news conference that just wrapped up here, the Milwaukee Fire Department says it's conducting its own investigation into the harassment claims. The Milwaukee Fire Department take any claims of discrimination, sexual harassment very seriously. We have zero tolerance for that. The fire department did not take any questions from reporters today at that press conference. Peden is due back in court in just a couple weeks. Live in downtown Milwaukee, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4. Thank you, Ben.